This sort of title fight. It's both it's guys to see how, how relaxed Sean Luther is. He's smiling, laughing, jerking. Yeah, it's a very nice chill guy. There from, from yeah, Kieran both, yeah, both guys look pretty calm. A little bit more frantic from, uh, from Kieran Sean looking at stuff that takedown. Yeah, that was nice. Nice knee as well on the counter and uh, working that wizard at the moment as well. Still holding that wizard. Great takedown defense for sure. This is nice. Really, really good tennis. Looking for that solid underhook and just trying to create some separation. Very nice. Spinning off the cage. 
He's looking to look for his eight and have his own there as well. He's trying to take it back as well. Fantastic takedown defense for sure. Really impressive. Really, really impressive. Sean Luke with a nice hand from Kieran there to start off. Oh, nice, like a spinning back fist there from Sean. I like the movement of Sean Luke there. Yeah, good pace early. But well, both guys got good movement. You see that there. Kieran's gone for the second takedown and tries to power him into the cage. But very impressed with the takedown defense of Sean Luke. Very, very good takedown defense. Nice hard knee as well. Knee. Very hard knee. There's a single. Want to get it? for that twisting single once again like you know the thing is I look Kieran's doing everything right here like you know he's he's maybe a little bit high on that single level he certainly wasn't when he attempted it he tried to drive through effectively but there's just it's just a, a very good level to take down a defense and awareness by Sean it's worth bearing in mind as we mentioned before this is three three four minute rounds it is yeah that's right now these continual takedown attempts from Kieran could start to really yeah round. because you know Sean's, Sean's got a, uh, an anaconda choke on there you know he's got that head and arm in there but he looked to drag him to the floor at the same time as well we've seen this choke used particularly effectively by uh, Minotauro Nogueira you know where he's, he's put people to sleep with this from this position here you know he's got under the armpit I mean I think he's going to use it just to control uh, control Kieran but, but actually you know that there is some danger there oh he, that was a really hard we heard that through the microphone there ladies and gentlemen Kieran just having no luck with these takedowns as Sean stopping everything. Really hard body kick there as well. That's taken the wind out of Kieran's side. It has taken the wind out. Well, you can see him visibly, uh, visibly breathing there with a bit of difficulty. You know, he's, uh, first, he's set a heck of a pace as Kieran, but he's, uh, he's, he's had those takedowns stuffed every time. That's, I think it's four or five now that have been uh, been stopped, and it's uh, it takes its toll when you're putting that much effort into them as well. Sean isn't giving him a second to catch his breath. Yeah, he's on him, isn't he? On him all the time. And he's still so relaxed. Time. Here's corner there, just going, calling for more and more pressure because he can see that, that Kieran visibly struggling and eats another head oh. kick on a right hand there as well. Those head kicks, they're getting blocked, but even on the forearms, Rich, they're going to be taking their toll. Oh, they are, and uh, once again using that great takedown defence and fantastic hip movement from, uh, from Sean to create a bit more separation. Kieran desperate to get this to the floor and eats another big knee there as well. He's just getting punished every time. He's he getting is, punished for the cardio, he's getting punished for the body with knees. That's right, and he's, uh, he's it wearing must, it a must bit must be demoralising, Rich. He's, he's doing everything right, it's the problem, he's got a stage now where he's looking visibly tired already in this first round because, you know, it, it, like we said at the start, this could come down to a battle of wills and if you can't impose your game plan on somebody, it can tire you very quickly, lovely head kick there for sure. But it's early days Superman and anything can happen. As well. Kira's working very, very so hard He's just punishing him every time he comes into the clinch. Sean's just looking to hurt him, just, just to make it difficult, but lovely low leg kick, oh, great take down there from Kieran, really well worked, and Sean pops straight back up again. But excellent perseverance from Kieran though, he's sticking to his game plan, he knows what he has to do. You know, he knows he can get that now, he's got it, but, you know, one from seven's probably, it's better than none from six, certainly, anyway, you know, he's, uh, he needs to know he can, do, he can, he can take this guy down. Oh, a front kick to the face, tired. not a lot on that kick, but it landed, Sean. it landed clean. It's been a hard, oh, beautiful right hand over the top as well. It's been a hard first round for Sean here. Wow. Sean, uh, Sean really imposed his will there. The story of that first round obviously just been Kieran's inability to take Sean down. Sean, yeah. just, Sean just staying on his feet no matter what. Showing some tremendous takedown defence. Some of the best I've seen in a, in a, in a, in a cage in, in front of my very eyes. I must say, you know, Sean is, is extremely impressive, but we are only a quarter of the way through the fight. Now both these guys are going to be getting direction, strategy, tactics from their corners, coaching. And yeah. any one of them might come out with a tweak or something that's just going to make that difference. If I'm honest, I think they'll tell Sean to do more of the same. You know, wait for the takedown to come, sprawl it, and put your hands and feet on the guy. Kieran, the advice will just be that you're going to have to persevere with these takedowns because you're going to have to work and work and work to get him on a guy like Sean who's just is unwilling to go on the floor at this moment in time. Not, not that he's probably not more than capable on the floor, but just right now he's having good success on his feet. And actually, you know, he's winning the wrestling battle at this point here because he's just proving almost impossible for, uh, for Kieran to take down. And I suppose ultimately, you know, if, if Sean's having more success on the feet, which he seems to be doing as well, it's even more important that Kieran gets this fight to the ground as it quick is, as he possibly can and start imposing his will. That's 100% correct, Al. He needs to get this to the floor just because he hasn't fared as well as the stand up as, uh, as Sean has thus far. Like I said, adjustments will be made and uh, we'll see what Kieran's got now. 
certainly has a well-rounded game. You know, we've seen the great variety of kicks and head kicks and, uh, and all sorts of movement from Kieran, but Sean just looking a little bit, a little bit more impressive on his feet. There's a bit of any pep in the step of Kieran Lister in this second round. Yeah, there is. He's, he's coming out there and he's, uh, he's he's looking to exchange a bit. Eight hard jab there. I wouldn't be surprised if his corner's told him to get, get Sean on his back foot and start pushing him backwards, taking away some of the power. You know, I think that's exactly what's happened. I think his corner said, get in there and strike with him. Obviously, obviously Kieran can strike. It's pretty obvious he's, he's got some talent there. And they've probably just said, back him up a little bit, push him a little bit. And then the takedown will be there. Whereas if you're constantly pushing for it, there's just time that, you know, you, you can be flogging a dead horse sometimes if you're not setting stuff up. Short, Ooh, nice uppercut up there. Short right uppercut. Forces a takedown there from Kieran and uh, sprawled again. Once again, Sean controlling the cage and uh, Kieran looking to unlock on it, uh, you know, the keys to getting to the floor, perhaps. And Kieran's still moving well. He's still right. putting his combos still together. Well, as well. He's got nice take that set there. Changed his level really well there. Drove up against the cage, but just couldn't quite get to his hips in the time he wanted. And, uh, oh, Sean's got to He's himself taken down by Sean. Nice active guard here from Kieran as well. Like he's uh, Kieran's coach there, advising him to get double wrist control on Sean and uh, you know look to throw his legs up and hit the submissions from his back. Playing a high close guard at the moment is Kieran so far, and uh, and Sean looking to posture and land some shots. Now could it have been a gamble on behalf of Sean Luther to willingly go into you the know, guard of Kieran Lister? It's always a gamble with a skilled ground fighter to, to hit the floor, but you know. You can't be, if you're going to fight for a title, you can't be scared to take the fight anywhere it turns up. And, 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 and getting yourself a takedown does wonders for you, you know. Sean's had his way on his feet kind of a little bit. And now to get a takedown is it, quite, you know, it's quite tough on a, on a tired Kieran Lister as well. Looks like he's looking to isolate that arm. Yeah, I think he's looking to kind of pin that arm and look to maybe hit a stack pass on one side so he can actually get through and, and to advance his position because uh, Kieran's certainly not going to give him anything on the floor, but... Yeah, he's looking to, to control that arm underneath and uh, land the strikes and hopefully unlock uh, unlock his guard so he can get to that left hand side and catch as well. But uh, you know, Kieran quite canny and, and getting his arms free. Kieran back to that door wrist control now, looking to isolate arms and uh, any spare limbs that are going and trying to hit a sweep there under the Moran. Pretty sort of successful there. Uh, again, the base is Sean looking, looking for that left arm uh, Kimura there, and uh, I think he's still kind of got it. Uh, Sean defending well. Sat down on that on that hand just to make sure he can't, he can't isolate that arm and, and look to extend that submission. He's got his, his left arm tucked underneath his leg. So. Again, Kieran tries to explode out. Yeah, there's a solid base there from, from Sean. It's not allowing Kieran to do it right a lot, but Kieran's, you know, making plenty of attempts to try and advance his position from the bottom. Looks like Sean might want him back up, possibly. Yeah, they're back on their feet. Lovely left head kick there from, uh, from Sean, and he took a couple of punches from Kieran as well. Spinning back this end after the leg kick as well. Good level change, but just can't seem to can't seem to get that, that takedown. Two very skilled fighters going at it so far, Al. Like, uh, absolutely, absolutely. Wonderful fight here for the lightweight title. Okay, and that's round two in the books. I think it's not unfair to say that. Sean Luther is a fresher looking fighter at this point, but then he hasn't had to do as much physical hard work as Kieran. No, I think there's, there's that, that plethora of takedowns early on from, uh, from Kieran's visibly exhausted him so far. He's, he's had a really hard first round and a hard second round as well, but some, uh, some real signs of promise so far from, uh, from Kieran. But Sean, just getting the better of it anyway. Step. He was much more offensive, and I think, well, ultimately, might not have given, given him a completely different result at the end of the judges' eyes. I think certainly gives Sean more to think about, and it should have a little bit more of Sean Luther's striking game. Yeah, definitely. And he, he had some good success in his, his own striking game in Kieran, and uh, you know, the, the early take that from Sean maybe took Kieran off his game a little bit. You know, he, he 
spent a reasonable amount of time on his back there, trying to launch some offense. But a uh, good second round, can't wait for the third. Okay, round three. Sean Grinning looking like he's really looking forward to this. Again, Sean is one of the most relaxed fighters I've seen for a very long time. He just looks really happy to be here. He's just uh, having a wonderful you know, time, Rich. When you, when you love fighting, that's uh, it's fun to do what you love. So. Looks like he was setting up a spin again there. Yeah, he was, but uh, Kieran keeping his arms high as well, not really giving Sean much to work off. Nice left hook and try to with a kick there, very nice. We'll put together a combination. He's a bit of a right hand there from Sean, a quite a stinging right hand over yeah. the top there. And finally gets that power oh, oh, lovely yes, save down and avoids the reversal as well. That was a beautiful, beautiful very take nice takedown. What we always knew Kieran had, but uh, was just struggling to get away. And all he actually do was, like his corner had been shining the whole time, is set up those takedowns. Or put his hands on Sean a little bit and then force that good double. Because as we saw in the first round, he has very good takedowns and just went too often and too early with him. Yeah. We're looking to advance his position here at the moment. And, uh, Sean not allowing him uh, any time to think about it, where he keeps working on his head here. Stacking up to try and get past his hips. Sean attacking the uh, Kimura there. He's got the overhook on that left arm Kimura there, but Kieran bases out of it. Kieran now struggling to avoid that takedown from Sean as well. Sean now trying to look to change his position with the takedown, and, and Kieran just pulling his hips back. But I think he may have just been heavy enough on that takedown to get in that position, and now he's taking that reverse of fortune. Yeah, taking that. Top position there, looking to take the back and ends up in half guard. Very quick of Kieran there. He, he said he said shot 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 from from half guard. <laughs> Neil Blitz drop scene between the two fighters is giving him a certain amount of Very nice shots from there. And Kieran needs to tie him up and either get back to full guard or bad position because those shots are really thudding in. And these are hard body shots as well. Sometimes yeah, it's yeah, hard to yeah. judge exactly how hard they are, but take my word for it, the competition position, they're literally feet away and they're they're reverberating through the table we're sat at. Playing half semi mounted here at this point, which is uh, not not a good position to be in, but does allow him a little bit of movement to, to get some elevation on uh, on Sean. Sean looking to pass. He's passing. Kieran not giving him anything. He wants to get that half butterfly back in half mount position there, but uh, you know if he can if he can pass that leg, he doesn't really want to be mounted by Sean. And Sean looking to stack that leg and take side control, but the. Uh, the defensive, defensive guard work of Kieran, very impressive. Yeah, we're really starting to see the, the, the BJJ skills of Kieran Lister coming to the fore here. But, you know, not necessarily offensively necessarily, but certainly from a defensive position, he's, no, he's, he's regaining uh, half guard. He's currently still trying to attack that, that right arm now, Sean, as well, with an overhook tomorrow, or possibly a pressing arm bar as well. But without much time, he's going to struggle to, to get that out there. Uh, Sean's base is heavy on him at this moment in time. Taking no risk at this point, he's short, landing a couple of shots, but you know, trying to protect that arm as well. Yeah, it's get, once again getting between his own legs there to prevent it from being yeah, overextended. He's, he's not quite managed side control there, and, and re-guarded is, is Kieran there. It's very, very slick with his control of his hips, but uh, you know, both guys, good level jiu-jitsu for both guys. Absolutely. It's just the, the, the heavy posture and pressure of Sean just is it's wearing Kieran down at this moment. And the ground and pound is pouring in as well. Holding a furious pace for Sean Luke at this moment in time. He hasn't slowed he down. He has not stopped working and working. Okay. Neither is Kieran. You know, Kieran's constantly looking to advance his position. He's trying to keep himself in his fight, but he's getting some shots now from, uh, from Sean. And that's the third Excellent. round in the Thank <laughs> you.